are going to show you on how to adjust the dryness of your sludge cake. There are three ways in which you can adjust the dryness of your sludge cake. The first way is by reducing the sludge feed inlet. The sludge feed inlet can be reduced by pumping, controlling the pumping from the sludge feed pump. The second way is by adjusting the overflow bypass line to limit the flow rate which is going to your sludge press. The second way you can adjust the dryness of the sludge cake will be adjusting the speed of the screw. The speed of the screw can be adjusted by a VFD controller provided here. The knob provided here can be adjusted to adjust the screw. What we have done here is we have switched on the screw press screw and we will try to reduce the speed of the screw from the VFD controller provided here. So you can see that I am slowly reducing the frequency of the VFD and it will ultimately reduce the speed of the screw. If you are not able to adjust the dryness of the cake either by adjusting the feed flow or the screw speed, you can try doing both. The third way you can adjust the dryness of the sludge cake is by adjusting the pressure plate. The pressure plate has two settings which are provided with the help of gauge strips 3mm and 5mm. The pressure plate, to adjust the pressure plate, we need to first loosen the nut provided here. Please loosen the nut provided here with it. So we can see that the pressure plate is loose, loose and we can adjust the pressure plate based on our desirable sludge dryness. The sludge dryness to adjust on the maximum level is by adjusting the pressure plate and keeping it to the 3 mm setting which is this one. This is the 3 mm gauge strip which will result in the most dry sludge cake from our screw press. So friends, these are the three methods by which you can adjust the dryness of the sludge cake. These three methods can be used in standalone or in combination with each other or all of them to adjust and optimize the dryness of the cake along with your feed capacity. Thank you.